Hi everyone, uh, welcome here to the uh, Z-Wave Alliance uh, area. We're at uh, IC West, uh, Fabaro uh, Home Automation. Uh, we are showing our products here. Uh, we actually have two different booths, uh, but here we have uh, basically two different controllers. Uh, we have the light version, and then we've got our big main controller, which calls Home Center 2. Uh, in the alarm industry, uh, there's some alarm integration that we can do uh, with both of our controllers uh, into legacy alarm systems, uh, basically being able to pull in all the controls or all the sensors uh, from those uh, legacy alarm systems and uh, then utilizing Z-Wave and home automation. Um, some of the other devices that we're showing here, uh, we've got our uh, award-winning uh, motion sensor. Uh, this just won a design award. Uh, it's got a light temperature, accelerometer and obviously motion. Uh, there's a, a light, uh, the diode that actually changes colors depending on what's happening in the room, if it's too cold or if it's too warm. Um, you can change the colors. It, can, uh, it actually has a built-in Z-Wave network range testing. Uh, obviously you can see how small it is. Um, some of the other products, uh, we have a flood sensor. Our flood sensor uh, also can be wired into an alarm system. So it's got uh, 12 or 24 volt DC uh, that you can run into it and then the battery is a backup. Um, this unique device also won a design award. Uh, it floats on top of water. It's got a built-in Z-Wave network range tester. Um, it's got telescoping feet, so it's always making sure that it's making contact with the ground. So something else that we got, we show, uh, in the next couple months we'll have our, our new um, outlet uh, for the US out. Um, this unique device has got uh, two separately controlled uh, Z-Wave uh, outlets. Uh, it'll actually change color depending on how much power is being used. So if it's got a hair dryer going into it or if it's got something like a, a tea kettle, the color will change depending on how much energy is being used. Um, we also have two USB ports at the bottom. So those also show energy monitoring. So you've got four separate devices here that are controlled and energy monitored. At the device level itself, there's a little LED that'll show you a digital readout and how much power is being consumed. Uh, last feature, which is very unique as well, we put a rotating 90 degree, degree uh, uh, plug. So when you plug this into an outlet, if it's uh, vertical or horizontal, uh, you can actually switch it to, to match which way your outlet's going. Um, last but not least, we just got the, some of our other micro modules. Uh, we've got RGB lighting control, we've got our uh, micro uh, relay switch, double relay switch, and then we've got a dimmer. Um, these basically go in behind your, your switches or your outlets, and now they enable them to be Z-Wave and part of the home automation system. For more information, you could visit us at uh, fibaro.com, that's F-I-B-A-R-O.com, uh, or you can uh, visit our YouTube channel uh, and see uh, some of our great new videos or Mount Everest, uh, we have the Mount Everest Challenge, which is uh, for borrowEverest.com.